Attorney-client privilege protects confidential communications between a company and its lawyers. When one corporation acquires another, does it also acquire the seller corporation's relationship with its counsel? That's the question in Techniplex versus Miner and Landis. Miner and Landis was Techniplex's longtime counsel, representing the company in multiple areas, including environmental compliance. Tom Tang became Techni's sole shareholder, president, and chief executive. Tang and Techni entered into a merger agreement with TP Acquisition Company. Miner represented both Tang and Techni in the transaction. Acquisition, a shell corporation, purchased all Techni's assets, rights, and liabilities. Acquisition changed its name to Techniplex, which we'll call New Techni, and continued the company's business. Old Techni dissolved. The merger agreement warranted that Old Techni was compliant with all environmental laws. After the transaction, New Techni initiated arbitration against Tang, alleging misrepresentations concerning Old Techni's environmental compliance. Minor represented Tang in the arbitration. New Techni moved in state court to disqualify Minor. The trial court enjoined Minor from representing Tang or disclosing to Tang any information obtained from Old Techni. The court also ordered Minor to give New Techni all its files related to representing Old Techni. The appellate division affirmed. Minor appealed to the New York Court of Appeals.